An investigation is underway at Biolab, a chlorine product manufacturer in Westlake, after smoke poured from the plant this morning and forced many to shelter in place. Good evening, I'm Cynthia Arsenault, and tonight we have team coverage of the chemical incident. We start with KPLC's Teresa Schmidt. About 8.30 in the morning, the Calcasieu Office of Homeland Security issued a precautionary shelter in place for the area around Biolab. Officials say it was due to a chemical incident causing billowing smoke from a warehouse there. The shelter in place first extended a quarter mile around the plant and later was expanded to a half mile radius. Calcasieu Emergency Preparedness Director Jared Mays says this is what they know so far. It was some residual of a pro of their products and bio uh, product of their uh, normal products that they produced that uh, for chlorine uh, tablets stuff for pool supplies. So it was a combination of that and uh, some pallets and stuff that were stored in that area. While some may have caught wind of a distinct smell, Mays explains that doesn't necessarily indicate harmful amount of chemicals in the air. There was a combination of some of the smoke and a mixture of a chlorine smell that did go off site. Uh, no large impact to the area. People in the area were notified in various ways from phone alerts by OSEP, law enforcement, and the media. While initial information is sometimes inexact, May says it's always better to err on the side of caution. When in doubt, always shelter in place until you get further information, either from the media or from us, that is a precautionary measure just to protect yourself. Advice that's appreciated by many accustomed to living in a chemical manufacturing area. I, I was glad we heard about it and I'm glad it was nothing serious, but you know, I have to trust that the industries are always going to inform us and um, all the officials are going to do the right thing and, and get the word out there. An investigation into the cause of the incident is underway. Teresa Schmidt, 7 News. Louisiana DEQ says monitors at the plant reported non-detect chlorine readings, which they say indicates chlorine levels were within safe limits. They say air monitoring will continue in the area. In a statement, the company official said, quote, Biolab can confirm it has now fully contained the smoke previously emanating from its facility and expects to resume operations at its facility in short order. We are grateful to our employees on site who are all accounted for with no injuries reported. We also want to thank the first responders and local authorities for their collaboration in swiftly bringing this incident under control. As always, the safety and well-being of our community in Lake Charles remain our top priority, end quote. Now, this isn't the first time an incident like this has happened in our region. KPLC's Omar Martinez has more information on the history of such cases at Biolab. 